San Diego, we have a series of marine protected areas, or MPAs, and they're really the foundation of our ocean ecosystems here in San Diego County. This is where the primary productivity is happening, where a lot of fish spawning is going on. When you talk to groups like the spear fishermen and lifeguards and surfers, they're really seeing more wildlife. In 2012, California's existing network of marine protected areas was expanded to include MPAs in San Diego County. And this includes 11 sites. Think of the ocean resources off of California over the last couple hundred years. There's been series, wave after wave, of over-exploitation. So the idea is to kind of protect important habitats for some species and repopulate the fished areas. I would say the lagoon has really come back. Just below the surface of the water here, there are sites that still can be found there. They're just not set up to to protect the fish and protect the other living creatures. They also protect the human remains that are there, or the things that are left there by us. The community are the watchers, are the stakeholders of these MPAs. So the scientists have was created and now we have to take care of them. You can't just go out and on a map and say this area is protected and end it at that. You have to provide that the laws are enforced. It's been really important for us to engage communities across San Diego County, as diverse as the region is, on recreating these places, educating about these places, and then engaging in the stewardship. The youth groups that we've worked with have been tremendous in, in helping us protect these places. They've participated in advocating for more support from our elected officials. They've helped us with cleanups. So they've really been involved from a policy level all the way to a ground level. We go to schools and youth groups such as Girl Scouts, Boys and Girls Clubs, conservation clubs at schools. And when we take them to these areas and they see that for the first time or see the sea lions for the first time, they get really inspired. And that's one of our goals, to have these people fall in love with these areas and want to protect them. Coastal wetlands like this are an important area for the survival of fish in the ocean. That's not necessarily a logical link to people. Having this designated as a marine protected area gets people to understand that. They're all part of a system. Mm -hmm.